guys, so this is Raf and welcome back. So today, we will unbox this iPhone XR. And I just renewed my contract with my telco recently and they gave me this phone. I believe that this iPhone XR is much better than the iPhone SE as an entry level iPhone. I also noticed that the box are now smaller than before. And that's because Apple's initiative for being eco-friendly. So let's open now the box. So here is the iPhone XR with the black color. And this is with the 64 gig of storage. So let's try to remove it from the box. And its size are almost identical with my iPhone 11. This black color really looks good and feels premium. Build quality on iPhone sir. Oh, it's great. It does have a one rear camera and it has a glass back with aluminum side. And this have a rating of IP67 for water and dust resistance for its protection. Other than the iPhone XR itself, we do have here also the lightning to USB type C cable. We also have this small paperwork with some instruction manuals for setting it up. It does have also this SIM ejector tool and its famous white Apple sticker. With Apple being eco-friendly, they decided to not include power bricks anymore, which is sad. Let's remove this plastic. All right, so here is the screen. It's a 6.1 inch LCD screen. Since you already unboxed it, so the next step will be setting this up. So first, um, it will ask you on what country you are. So for me, I'll be choosing here in the Philippines for my country. And then it will show the quick start. Just set it up manually. So it will tell you the languages. Just hit continue. And then it will let you connect to your Wi-Fi. And of course, you need to put your Wi-Fi name and password. So already input here the password of my Wi-Fi, so it's loading right now. Some data and privacy options, and then setting up your face ID and creating password. So for me, I'll be just using generic password here temporarily and so that we can proceed here on the setup. After creating the password, um, it will be the apps and data. So you can choose to restore it from your iCloud backup or restore it from your Mac and PC or transfer it um, from your old iPhone to this new iPhone. So we need also to log in with your Apple ID. It's already done here. It's loading right now. And I choose this express setting for now. And then hit continue to keep your iPhone updated from, from its softwares. And then I'll be just choosing to continue here. Uh, I don't normally use iCloud Keychain. And then screen time, yes continue uh, I don't share the analytics as well and I just disable this true tone display you can enable it if you want it but for me I'll disable it for me and then you can choose also the appearance and also the zooming so welcome to the new iPhone so with this this is the main screen of the iPhone XR so all of the Apple apps there it's already been downloaded and also the widgets and as you can see here it is not currently updated so i'll be just going to the software updates and let's see what ios version it is right now mm, okay so we need to update it to ios 15 so i'll be just clicking this download and install and then you just need to enter your passcode or normally you need to have your face id Alright, so I already updated it to iOS 15 and everything is set up right now. And my first impression here is it really looks like on my iPhone 11. Um, the only difference here would be there's an extra camera on iPhone 11 and also um, a better processor. Because this processor is already old, the 812 Bionic chip. But anyway, it's, it's still fast actually. Um, it's still smooth here. Um, like every iPhone does and there's no any issue I was able to find currently with the iOS 15 but I'll be testing it more and I'll be creating the review here in the coming weeks so that is my unboxing of this iPhone XR 
And thank you for watching my video. Please like, share, and subscribe. And see you soon. Peace out.